Hey guys, I'm LB, and welcome back to the second episode of Cube, episode 1. If you are looking for the first episode, that would be episode 0. I'm back in range. Fingers crossed. Look, Mission Control think that if you have lost your memory, me just giving you little details about yourself won't be enough to spark anything. They want me to read something more specific. Something very personal to you. So, I want you to know. I'm only reading this because you wrote it to yourself. It was 3 p.m. on a Sunday. You were upstairs at home. A teenage boy broke into your house. He thought you were away on vacation. You went downstairs with your gun. You shot him in your living room. Only he wasn't trying to rob you. He was passing by and saw a fire in your kitchen. He broke in to try and put it out. He was young and stupid, and probably should have thought of a better solution. But you assumed the worst. You assumed the very worst, and you shot him. He was paralyzed from the neck down. He died seven years later, alone, at night. Penrose St. Francis Hospital. I'm orbiting out. I hope that helped you. Fingers crossed. Wow, manslaughter. What a backstory for our character. The only thing we know about our character, other than his backstory, is that he has hands. Or she. Could be a she, we don't know. Did- Oh, did we say- did- did they say we had a wife? I don't remember. We might be a man after all. Alright, let's get going here. Ah, so this is where we get to color mixing. I already figured that out last episode. Right, right. Okay, so... If I remember correctly... Oh, wrong way. Whatever. Hey, I can fix it anyway. And, uh... Oh, how am I... Right. I should probably do this. That'll help. Yeah, okay. Let's get this started again. Uh... Oh, I was late on the draw. Let's, let's try again, please. Thank you. And then once we've done that, we can do this. Oh, I guess we could also use that, but... This seems to roll gravitor yeah, gravitate towards the center, and that usually has been working out for me so far. So let's just let it do its thing, and it'll go in there. Ta-da! Like magic. So next... We want to do green, which would be yellow and blue. So there's yellow, and here's blue, and then we do this. There we- oh. <laughs> well, we've made- oh. Right, right! This is like Chroma Gun. Okay. I completely missed the fact that we're dealing with blue, red, and yellow, and not red, green, blue. So yeah, we have, uh, different primary colors than I'm used to, so this is more like Chroma Gun then, so that's why we got brown and not white. If it had been red, green, blue, we would've gotten, uh, we would've gotten white. Let's think about this. Oh. <laughs> I'm dramatically overcomplicated things, as usual. Yellow. And then we want... Blue, oop, blue, okay, well, that's- that's what happens when you can't aim very well. Come on. Oh, come on, please. There we go. Yellow. Blue. And then... Get it over to green. Ta-da! There we go. Okay, so now, I think we just want yellow and red to make orange. Correct? I believe so. What would actually be the best way to do that, though? Hmm...
I think I'd have to hit it at the last second with this. Alright. Let's try it. There we go. Perfect. 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 We shall continue. Achievement unlocked. Sector 4 completed. I did notice that the recording was a bit stuttery last episode, so I reduced the recording frame rate so that hopefully it has less work to do and can actually keep up with the game. And I did have to manually edit game files to make sure that this game doesn't use up all my CPU. Which I have very little experience with. You season. listen. I know you're gonna hear me down there. She's lying to you. She's a liar. You're not where they say you are. They'll leave you alone to die in the dark. Interesting. What the heck is going on right now? What a odd change. I don't remember this at all. I have no memory of this. Oh, I think I slightly remember this. So we can change the color of all the blocks at once. Or... Oh, no, we can only show... certain colors at a time? Okay, I thought it had something to do with this. Okay. So, is this still here, even if I can't see it? Yes. Yes, so they are still here, even if I can't see them. But... I can't... Can't interact with it if it's not visible. Fair enough. Oops. Oh, I fell off. Let's try that again. Also, yep, it actually does block my view. Cool detail. Okay, so we are on red, and we want to get to yellow. Oops, wrong- wrong click. Let's get up here. Cool. I'm sure this does wonders for YouTube compression, and I mean that in a non-sarcastic tone. I hope you can hear me. The lights on the outside of the cube have gone dark. Mission Control think that's good. They say you must have hit it somewhere that hurts. <laughs> so keep doing what you're doing. I know it's tough being alone out there. I've been alone here on the International Space Station for... over a month. Going... round and round and round the Earth. And after a while, it messes with your head. The truth is, if you leave a person alone in the dark long enough, they'll lose themselves. I'm orbiting out of range. Keep going. I'll be back soon. Okay, so either she's lying to me, or the game developers don't understand science, or I don't understand science. Because if she's on the International Space Station, that's not very much closer than Earth. <laughs> like, Mission Control should be able to talk to me at that range. Like, I mean, relative to how far we are supposedly at, the International Space Station and Earth are, like, right in the same spot. That- that doesn't make any sense to me. So it could be me not understanding science, it could be the- the game developers not understanding science, or she could be lying. Hopefully it's the latter. Alright, let's- let's see what we're working with here. Oh, we have a, a block. 
Yeah, okay. Oh, we can turn stuff off, I didn't even consider that. Let's, uh, let's push the block here, right? Yeah, okay, then where exactly... Oh, I guess we just want to stand on it, right? Yep, that works. Interesting. I don't remember this dark section very much. Goes to show how little I remember this game from other, uh, playthroughs of it. Also, wow, this is... really... hard to keep everything straight in my head and know where everything is. Oh, and we've got rotation. <laughs> oh, goodness. Where's the... what does this rotate? Oh, I can't change it while it's rotating. Okay, that rotates that. And I'm assuming pink is... What? Oh no, wrong- wrong color. This is what I wanted. Can I still bounce off of it if I can't see it? Yes! Alright, lesson learned. So, we can't see it, we can't interact with it, but we can still bounce off of it, which is kind of strange, but I'll- I'll go with it. And then... We want to do this, please? Okay, so actually we don't want to do that. We want to... maybe do more like... this. Yeah, that should work. I don't have to wait so long between clicking. That is one of my complaints so far. There we go. And just so we can see... Thank you. We are up here now. Ominous. But absolutely fine, I'm sure. I don't remember. Is that how the Wheatley quote... We yeah, Wheatley quote goes? I don't remember. Oh, gosh. Oh, goodness. Hmm... Is there a wall here? Yes, there's a wall here. Good. I see where the ball drops some if I turn green on? No, I cannot. I just have to have known that it was gonna drop there. Okay, so, I see how this works now. Let's, uh, redo this. Ta-da! There you go. And you go. Oh, it retracts them for me. How nice. Okay, what next? Oh. That would probably help. Okay, I didn't even notice that I had access to that. Let's do that. Slam it in the place, and then lift it. Come on. Aim, please. <laughs> Thank you. And... Oh, now we just... Oh, they're on the floor. Okay. I was wondering about that. What is with... I guess this always makes it go to the side. Alright then. So let's see, where's our yellows? There's our yellows. There's that. Alright then. Come on. 
come on, come on, thank you. I wonder... So if we do this again... That did not quite have the effect I wanted. Come on. What if we do that, and rotate this the other way? I want it to land on a red guy. Okay, well that... maybe will work, perhaps. Oh, come on, that was so close. Let's do that again. I don't understand why I can't do things while these are rotating, that's actually very annoying. That was too early. Let's try this again. And that was too late. Let's try that again. I'm sure there's a better way to do this. But this is the way that makes the most sense to me. What if... Come on, what if I just do this? Oh! <laughs> that, that works! That is definitely a much better way! No! Ah, why? Why did you do that, game? I had it! I had it and everything. Come on, game. Don't be like that with me. That was the wrong direction. What? Come on, why is it doing that? Uh... You know, this really feels a lot like a gimmick, cause... There's... Why- why can't I just see everything at once? That doesn't really make much sense to me. It was cool at first, but now it just feels gimmicky. Like, it's not actually something that... changes the way the puzzle works, it just makes it take longer to get anything done. And I apologize if you can't actually see the ball like I can, but... I- I can see the ball faintly. I know YouTube does weird stuff to dark scenes. Hmm... Oh, well that- duh! I think I might have just figured out the intended solution that is incredibly obvious, and yet somehow I didn't see it. There we go! Why didn't I just do that the first time? <laughs> <laughs> Overcomplicating, as usual. Hey, now we can see everything again. Awesome. Story? I don't have much power left. I've been listening from inside my box. They say you're out in space. You're not. You're underground. They buried you alive down there so they could test you. They're going to test you 
and test you until you rot into dust. And they do something to your memory. They did it to mine. They don't want you to remember who you are because if you don't know what's happening, you'll have faith that it will end. You'll have faith that someone will let you out of the dark, but they won't. You have to rip that faith out of your skull and replace it with truth. Or you'll die down there. Well, there's not much a protagonist can do to change the path of a linear story, so... Might as well just give up now. Interesting architecture. This looks like a beam of solid energy or something. Cool. Ooh. And would you look at that, it is a beam of solid energy. Ooh. Why does it go up, though? Does it always go up, or just... Or is that just, you know... Is it because that's there, or... Like, would it ever go to the side? Questions! I want answers! Come on, come on! There you go. Wow, it actually... Interesting. Okay, so here's the question, right? How do I get up? Oh, I bet I'm supposed to have gone... ...up here when the box was in the air first, right. That works as well. There we go. Problem solved. I guess they just always go up. That's the door. So you might as well go up there already. time. Oh, I missed. There we go. Then we turn it off, and we retract a couple times. Ta-da! Perfect. And it opens this, right? Yep, good. Perfect. Okay, fingers crossed you can hear me again. I have good news. Actually, two pieces of good news. We've started to see a definite effect on the cube itself. Parts of the outer layer seem to be coming apart. Whatever you're doing in there is working great. Second piece of good news. Mission controls say you're almost close enough for them to contact you directly. So we're going to organize a link up to your wife. She is dying to talk to you. Just keep going, and we'll make it happen. I'm orbiting out of range again, so good luck. Be that sounds very manipulative. That that sounds like they're holding my wife hostage unless I solve more of the tests. Hmm. Very suspicious. Okay, this looks like a pretty simple test. Oops, wrong direction. Ooh, that was kinda hard to do in quick succession. 
That one works, and... Wait, where am I actually supposed to... Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> uh, once again, I needed to do it while I was actually up there, first of all. So let's get ourselves up there. Wait, how actually do I do... Oh... Wait... Yeah, I can't make that jump. I have to stack them. Well, alright then. Stack it is. So here's the question, right? How will I sep- oh, well, separating them's easy as well. Come on! I did it wrong again! Alright. What? Uh... Game? Game? That's not supposed to happen! Why is that happening, game? Fine, we'll- we'll figure it out once we're actually up there. Oh, I didn't even go high enough. There we go, now I'm high enough. And now... There we go. Let's try this again. Maybe this'll work this time. Game... Don't test my patience, game. Why are they stuck together? Come on. That doesn't make any sense! What? That... no, that... No. Come on. What did I do? How else was I supposed to get up here without stacking them like that? Oh. Progress. Hey! Finally! I'm not entirely sure... how I managed to do that. But, I did. I separated them somehow. Alright. Turn off the magnet. Put these down. And then push them up. There we go. Uh... Oh, okay. There it goes. I was waiting, I was like, well, when's it gonna happen? Achievement unlocked! Attractive! Let's see, can we do this before the end of the episode? This looks rather... complicated. Uh, whoa. That was... very interesting what just happened to my camera view. That looked like a jump cut, but I promise that was not a jump cut. Hmm... Whoa, that- that is... that is... very bizarre. And what the heck is wrong with you, dude? Oh, c Really? How are we even supposed to do that, actually? I'm not entirely... sure. I'm unclear on the concept. Like this one... Okay, so it does go sideways sometimes. But I'm still unclear on the concept about this guy. I 
I'm not seeing a way to do this one. I don't know, I guess we'll have to figure it out next episode. So, as always, thank you for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. And if you enjoyed this video, or you hated it, there's a couple buttons below the video that you know what to do with. Goodbye!